And I went and saw the movie called Goosebumps. The review, I'm doing my review tonight about that movie. It is so goosebumpsy. I cannot believe it. I have goosebumps down my up and up arms and legs and some scenes and everything. Well, it's a great movie to take the kids to. And they, they've they seen it. And, you know, and I thought, hey, are you going to get to buy it now when it comes on DVD? Of course I, I said yes to them. On our way to the movie, we went and saw it before we were getting there. I was trying to make a little bit of a special act on the way there, thinking that I'm going to start going with the word goosebumps. Very good. Hmm? They were like, ah! They were, uh, no, they were just kind of like, why are you doing that? Well, I was just throwing a little act in there just to get them ready and bump them up, ready to go and see the movie. They're all enjoying it. <laughs> so, uh, you know, three kids plus me, I guess you got, uh, you know, four of us to, uh, I'll give you our, my grade at the end of this whole, yeah, at the end of this thing. So, as you can see, everything is all decorated in Halloween because it is about the, similar to the work of Goosebumps. It's got Halloween, some stuff in there. Even the movie, it's gotten some mummies and, oh, it's got lots of things, uh, scary things, even a puppet. Mm-hmm. Ventrilo quiz, I tell you. I think it's very interesting that, you know, it's got a little pudgy nose and it's like, it's like half his nose just got, you know, ripped off for some reason. I don't know what happened to that story in that, in that last thing. I am not a goosebumps. Um, I don't read any of them. I don't know anything about too much about them. I mean, I try to watch them on TV. I used to remember seeing them on TV. It's just like, uh I'll get to it when again. It is a very kind of movie that I think that the story comes out of the book called, you know, all these scary things come out of the book and terrorize the town and make everybody's life miserable. Hmm. Yeah, it's good. Um, I can tell you, it kind of brings back to the similarity to the other movies I've seen, like Jumanji and, and Scizor and, uh, yeah. And then, of course, The Night Museum. Hmm. In a different twist and they all just come back to life and they just kind of come out and just in their own stories taking over the universe per se and what's surrounding them and I also have to think that kind of reminds me of another series of movies or I should say TV show called Tales from the Crypt. I guess that's something though so no one really have put the terms of thinking that we have the nighttime show called Tales from the Crypt for adults. Then we got the goosebumps for the kids to terrorize them to, uh, hopefully they don't have nightmares. Um, it is not so bad a movie. I thought it was kind of funny. I was like, uh, it's more in the moment and thinking that, yeah, this is a funny movie to torturize kids. <laughs> not really. It's not that bad. Um, after I saw this, I was like, hmm. There's some uh, things that, you know, first his father, uh, you know, these people just moving in the neighborhood, he was like, yeah, yeah, I don't talk to my daughter. And, and then one thing that leads to another, and they heard some screaming, and then things goes in, and he goes and investigates, and, uh, no. I'll tell you one thing, that the city, the city, the funnier part, that the officers in that movie was just too funny that they, they were just like throwing this whole, you know, police work to shame. I thought, yeah, not so good. Um, yeah, I, I went ahead and saw this movie. I thought, hey, I'm just going to go ahead and just check it out because I thought, yeah, I saw the previews. I thought, yeah, well, okay, okay well, I'll, I'll just go see it. You know, add to my collection, to my movie reviews for you all to watch other than other ones down there. You can see as well. Or on the side. Um, so I thought... Why not talk about it tonight? It is not so bad. I'm not going to give away any spoiler. I'm not going to go, if you haven't seen it yet, please go check it out yourself. And I'm not going to, you know, prime you from it. At least you're going to see it yourself when you're ready or dare to. Yeah, watch it at your own risk. Not so bad. But I am, it is not, it not elaborate, you know, you know, too bad the movie. It's, uh, it's just the idea of, I, yeah, a bunch of these movies that comes and goes, you know, like that Jumanji comes out to life and all these characters and the villains are the, the people that come out of the books. And they're trying to, you know, you know you, and these villains, you know, it comes out of the book, they, they're just, uh, you can't kill them. They will never die. 
unless you find a way to end that story. That is where the character comes in play, trying to figure that out, and they will probably work together as a team. Even though the father thought about, mm, what are you doing talking to my daughter? And then all of a sudden, he gets involved in the whole story, and then he becomes like the hero at the end. I have to say that it is a, a movie for pretty much all ages, you know, it's a, I guess you could say it's a, it's a satire per se. It's like a, you know, it, it's about an hour and a half, almost uh, long enough, more than what you see in a 30 minute show of Tales from the Crypt. And it is that version of, I would think, uh, that it, it's got some things, you know, the guy uh, that Tales from the Crypt, that little skeleton talks to you. And he helps you read the story that you go into. Kind of like that. With goosebumps in the version of. And only the fact is that you go read the story and then all these people come to life. And then they, you know, these scary little monsters, the gnomes. Who I think they're cute. In the story in this movie, I don't think so. Ugh. They're cute. And then they, uh, and then they, uh, they were just not so nice. I have to say it was a cute little thing that they brought in a little poodle dog. That's probably just something you'll have to go see yourself. It was a cute little dog. It was kind of like giving a puppy eyes and then some things happen. Now, I'm not going to go into details because you have to go see it yourself. Um, I'll tell you there are some, lots of things that all these characters come and goes. So I was like, it was kind of a little too busy. It, it, it practically stopped. It, it was not non-stop. It was just on to go from one scene to the next scene. It's like, you're kind of like, what just happened a few minutes ago? I forgot what I just saw about, what? what? Oh my God, it's almost over with? How, how in the world is this movie almost over? You would think that maybe there's another hour and a half to go along with the hour and a half you've seen it. Well, maybe it could have been long enough. Maybe it should, could have been short enough. I have to say it could have been long enough. So we can actually get the, the aftermath story. We're too busy watching all the action that we just kind of like, oh, wait a minute. There is a plot in this whole movie. Um, so basically, overall, I have to give this movie and my kids. We have now discussed about the grading on this movie. It's called about A. No plus, no minus. Just A. Because I would just think it's practically um, my approval, if you could say. And I will discuss about that in another video about how I rate my movies in A, B, and C, and of course D. There's no E. There's no F. F if, if, if I have to rate a movie it's called an F grade, then I mean, you might not want to go see it. It's a waste of time. Well, this movie is not a waste of time. It's too funny to go not waste your time with. And I would think that maybe you should go see it yourself because it is too funny to take you off the chair. And it is, I, I felt like it was a Saturday Night uh, Live version of the whole story of the Goosebumps in a different twist, if you think of. And that, hey, well, you know, it's a good movie to take your kids to. They didn't have any problem with it. And I would have a little bit of a moment that my kids going, oh my God, that's so scary. I said, no, it's not. It's just a, it's not real. Don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> and then we, we got through it. So, anyways, now you know I give it about A. Yeah, and then I have to say the character and the cast were great. And I have to say, cast and crew of all the above, A plus for them. Because they pulled it off so well. And we have the guy from school from the rock, uh, School of Rock. How can you not laugh about him? He is so funny. I don't even, there's not one movie I've seen him in that he is so freaking funny. He's so surprising of how well he could do his work. So, I hope I said enough. And uh, here soon, um, I will be launching a, uh, yes, uh, Periscope. I'm going to go live and uh, do a video. And then I'm going to take some questions on Periscope Live. And I'm going to do it uh, and post it on YouTube so you, um, you guys can see my video. And I'm talking to them at the same time. So I'm actually going to be doing to a double thing. So maybe a little bit longer videos because I am going to take some re uh, requests and some videos that we're going to discuss. And I, I mean, hopefully I can ask them, uh, and help them out. And along the, at the same time, I'll help you guys out. And then we're just kind of going full circles. Yep. 
microwave. See how cute this little shirt is? Mm -hmm. Okay, getting with the uh, ending. Um, uh, overall, the movie is good to watch. Please go see it. It's still in theater by the time you see it. If not, it's good to buy. Please buy it on DVD and Blu-ray. And I wish they would actually make this movie a 3D because it was too funny, too good. You might as well get involved with the story if they had it in 3D. Maybe I would like it better. Anyways, I do like it. Anyways. Um, please get in touch with me with everything I am uh, on. I'm on Twitter, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. Uh, yes. Uh, all those little icons you can see on my channel that you can see right there. That you can click on any of those. That will take you to, uh, my direct place to, uh, reach me at. Or you can reach me at and please leave a comment down below, please. And that will explain, to, um, uh, uh, hopefully I can help you out, but I will not. And I promise you will, I will not go into, um, yeah, spoiler. I'm not going to give it away because I don't want to, I don't want to give anything away. You're going to have to go see for yourself. I'm just going to give you my overall overview, a review of the movie of how well I think it is. It's good to go see and it's too good to be funny. <laughs> so, after all, you know how to get in touch with me on everything I'm on. Uh, as soon as, as time goes on, I will be on Periscope Live and I will take all of the questions at the same time and talk to you all at the same time. At the, and it'll be all. They get to watch me live while I get uh, uh, posted and it takes a little bit longer to upload. So they get to see me think, uh, at the same time live and then, yeah, yeah. they will be there. Uh, that will be probably the next, uh, yeah, probably the next couple you know uh, videos to come so other than that i hope you all enjoy yourself and i hope i just uh cover everything i can you enjoy this wonderful background and my little decoration on my table my little friends spider yep can't you tell i love them i just don't like touching them don't get them near me thank you um other than that I hope you all are having a wonderful night, and please go see the movie called Goosebumps, my review. And you have just got buffin uh, buffinated, because the movie is so, you know, buffinated, I have to give it a whole approval to go see as soon as you can, or buy it, please. And, of course, all the comments and uh, suggestions and everything and feedback is great because you can all write down there. And please subs subscribe if you like what, you want, uh, like what you're seeing because I will have more stuff coming out and I'm not going to stop. Mm -mm. So, and please enjoy. Other than that, I hope I got you all goosebumps because it's got too much fun in it. Please go see it. Mm -hmm. Not so bad. So, all have a wonderful night and thank you. Oh, wow. Bye-bye.